just really waking up. I made my coffee, um, did my devotional, and I'm in here watching Sister Sister while the kids are still asleep. Y'all, I'm freaking tired for some reason. Um, we went to, Trey went to Zaxby's last night, and they pulled him up for a whole freaking hour, knowing I had to get up. So I stayed up waiting, it was like 10 o'clock. I'm normally in bed by like 8.30 at the latest. When I tell y'all, I'm so tired, and I got multiple doctor appointments. Like, as soon as I dropped the girls off this morning, um... I'm headed to um, my ortho appointment, which is literally 30 minutes away. <sighs> then I can come home and get a little bit of rest um, until I want to say three. And then I have like my general regular three month checkup at my doctor's. Mm -hmm. um, and then after that, I think at four, which I'm going to be pushing it because gotta be across the street i mean thank god it's across the street but then i have a gynecologist appointment at for like you know your regular pap smears and stuff i have that at four like i don't i don't want to do this on my day off <laughs> i would much rather lay in the bed relax wake up get my house together and all that good stuff because y'all, <clears throat> I'm literally exhausted. Right now, it's 6.33. Trey normally sends me a good morning message. That's our thing. That lets me know that he made it to work safe. Um, every morning, he sends it. And he didn't send it this morning. So I text him. I was like, baby, I know you're tired, but I want to make sure you're okay. Y'all, I know he is so tired. And then on top of that, he has to work Saturday as well. So he's got to go in Saturday morning. Then he'll get off. Um, and then we have to head like maybe 45 to minutes to an hour away to um, get to the recital. Y'all, I'm just not feeling it. Maybe when I do, like, my skincare routine, I'll wake up. Um, but I'm just, I'm not feeling it. Um, I woke up and started checking emails. Um, look at us. We were so young there, y'all. We were so young. But, yeah, that's, that's what I woke up doing. Um, I want to make sure highest tablet is charged, so I'm going to make sure I charge that when I go upstairs, because what us taking that long ride, I don't want her to be, you know, without her tablet. Um, the kids are wearing pajamas today. Um, it's a school type day today. I mean, a pajama type day for school, like Christmas. Um, and then tomorrow, they're having, like, parties, which that's why I got to hurry up and go get the teacher's gifts today. Um, after that, they're out of school, so I don't have to wake up as early. Because, literally, I don't get, I don't go to work until 9 o'clock. That's when I clock in. But I'm up at 6 because I have to get my body adjusted. I have to wake them up, make sure they have breakfast, make sure they're dressed and face wash teeth brush for school so um i have to make sure i'm on point so i get up you know super early but yeah it's time for a new set of lashes so i have to do that it won't happen today though my face is giving clear i gotta get something for my lips because this winter got my lips looking cracked and we ain't doing that I'm so excited to see the progress of my teeth, though. Um, I think I get my x-ray to see, like, how far they came. But, yeah, they're looking better. I'm going to post, like, a before and after 
um, so that y'all can see like how far I've came with my braces. Like I said, I got them. It wasn't last year. It was the year before, I think. I don't know. I got to check. But I'll definitely update y'all. But right now, I'm about to go ahead and finish checking my emails. Um, try to get this vlog uploaded before I leave. I have literally until 7.15 to be out the door. Um, so, it may be uploaded a little later. Um, but yeah, I'll check back in with y'all. I'll probably pick the camera up on my way to my appointment. And I'll vlog like my braces, um, getting them adjusted. So, have a great um Thursday and I'll see you soon. Hey y'all, hey y'all. Wanted to come in and show y'all um outfit up today. It's real really really cold. I went in with a bodysuit I got off of Sheet In. Um some ripped mommy jeans. I think these are so cute. And it's freezing so I got my Uggs on and like a um a coat that I got from the Banana Republic. So appointment, me and Haya. Say hey, YouTube. Uh, it's so nice in here. They even got something for like the kids, y'all. It's so nice, and no one's in here. I'm super early, but I want to stop by Ulta while I'm out here. Don't really know exactly what I'm gonna do, but yeah. So we'll pick the camera up when we get to the bed. Thank you for coming to the back. Bye. Bye. All right, y'all. Welcome back. So I literally just left the orthodontist. I got my braces adjusted. Um, I think they changed my bottom wire in my um for like my bottom brackets. I think they got changed, but um, I know my top ones did, and I had power chains on the top. Um, I chose the color rose. It's like a pinkish reddish, but I thought it would be cute for Christmas. So, um, I went ahead and, and chose that color. Um, I'm catching a headache. I don't know if it's the sun or like my anxiety, like being out and stuff. I don't know, but I'm catching a major headache. So what I'm gonna do is mm, get out this car. <laughs> go lay down for a little bit um in the process of laying down i'm gonna upload the vlog that i um recorded yesterday i'm gonna upload that for today um <clears throat> i'm off of work and my next doctor appointment is not until three and then i have one at four so i do have some leisure time that i can just get my house together after i wake up and <clears throat> for my nap and you know you know and so that's what i'll be doing today um i've been talking about this um <clears throat> salad bar that i've been wanting to go to so me and mooney we're gonna have like a little lunch date just me and her it's always good to spend that quality time like separated with your kids um like you know one-on-one -on -one time so um I'm gonna take her to the salad bar and we're gonna get some salad and all that good stuff and sit down and eat and then we're gonna head on over to the mall so that I can get these teachers they presents because y'all teachers deal with a lot I'm not a teacher but when I um homeschooled Nova like during COVID I took her out of school I couldn't do it y'all I could not do it so I want to just show appreciation and, and give them some kind of thanks. So I'm going to go to Bath and Body Works and get like um, little stocking stuffers for them. I feel like that would be cute. Comment below. What are y'all getting y'all's kids teachers? It's a comment below moment. I want to know what y'all are getting them. Am I going overboard by going to Bath and Body Works? I mean, because in reality, the stocking stuffers is only like between one to three dollars. Look at all my monsters shopping for their kids to get on teacher. Nova, 
You okay? You okay? You okay? Go ahead, Nori. Man, you all missing with something. Keep it sideways. Keep it sideways. Hey, y'all. Uh, Yo, mama. Love her. Chill. You got me holding this hand. Okay. Yeah, cool. Good. Hey, no way. Pay attention. I'm sorry. Pay attention. Why'd you bring that in here anyway? Come on, y'all. Ladies. Hey y'all, hey, we're just getting back from Bath and Body Works. Trey just took the girls to get um, dropped off at ballet. I wanted to show you all what I got. So we got the little gift bags. Um, I didn't do too bad, cause I had, you know, I'm a membership. Um, 67.30 y'all. Um, they have the cute little Christmas bags, of course. That might be a thumbnail. Um, so I got the Into the Night, y'all. This smells really good for their teachers. And then I got the Lavender, Lavender, Lavender Aromatherapy Sleep um, Lotion. These are for the teachers. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and put theirs in their bag. It's so cute. And y'all, they have the stocking still for this. Today was the last day for the sale. So it's not like I can warn y'all and be like, oh my gosh, go run to Bath and Body Works because this vlog, it'll be over. Um, All of the stuff was like picked around. Y'all, it was literally so packed in there. It was so packed. Um, But yeah, all the stuff were like uh, packed around and messed around and it was like literally scraps. It was, it was crazy. Um, but I'm just so thankful that we were able to get in there and get their teachers a gift because they deserve them. They got them something for Christmas, which was so cute. Um, Nori got an Operation Game Board. And uh, Nova got some like, uh, what's it called? Fingernail polish. Y'all, it was so cute. And it's about, Christmas is about giving. So, I'm always that parent that's going to appreciate those that take care of mine. These are the ribbons that come with it. It's like little bow ties. It says Bath and Body Works. Really, really cute. Super cute. It's got to focus. There we go. Um, And then, of course, I'm not going to Bath and Body Works if I'm not getting me anything either. <laughs> so y'all know me um i've been seeing this brand around a lot the um luminous this is the bottle it's looking like this it smells super super good um it's got ruby current isis all kind of stuff amber all kind of stuff in it and this is the actual glow lotion so it's like a glotion body butter I'm excited to see how this feels. Um, and the candles, y'all, were actually buy one, get one free. <clears throat> so I got a candle. Smells really good. Smell it. <laughs> but yeah, this is the Luminous. So I got kind of like the set. Um, this one was the free one. And it was, it was $17.95 for one. Um, so I kind of messed up and didn't do like the, uh, the sale, the candle sale. I waited too late. But overall, I'm excited with my little purchases that I have. Um, Big Daddy, actually, we were walking in the mall 
And this lady had like her little pop up shop. And y'all know I'm a big fan of Uggs. Like y'all, I rock my Uggs every year down to my kids. Like my kids love Uggs. That's just me. I'm a Ugg girl. And we came across this little Ugg fit. I'm not gonna open it. I'm gonna save it for under the tree. But baby was like, "Bae, that's Uggs." I was like, "Are you serious?" So he um he got it for me, y'all. And this is what it's looking like. This is the Ugg hat. They had, um, <clears throat> what did they have? They had green, like an olive green. I love that green, but it was going to be hard to, like, pair it. Um, they had, like, a grayish color, burgundy, and blue. And I was like, you know what, black, I can wear with anything. So, boom. Got my Ugg hat, and then it comes with the Ugg scarf. Y'all, to die for. Love it. Love me a good old Ugg situation now i'm about to attempt i wish i would have got something um something cute to put let me put the camera down so y'all can see but something like a little name tag or something but they were so busy in there y'all it was like i wasn't trying to be that person of asking for stuff if y'all know what i mean how i'm gonna do this with my nails i'm about to attempt do it this is too cute so y'all i said i was gonna cook tonight i said i was gonna do some chicken and on um, rice i wanted that tonight but we got done with everything and then my baby even though i'm off he has to work so i was like we're just gonna grab some takeout tonight don't know what I'm still thinking on what i want to eat <laughs> Somebody should have told me not to get my nails this long. Y'all, I am struggling with these nails. Y'all help me. Oh no, it's coming apart. Y'all help me. Let's see, maybe if I bend it. <laughs> Y'all, it should not be this hard to do a ribbon. I would hate to learn how to have to do my own, tie my shoe. Let me do it one more time. I don't want it to open. See. Okay, there we go. So this is what it's looking like. I did it. One down. Y'all were going down. One down and one to go. I mean, three to go. But yes, y'all, I'm excited. I've seen a couple names. Um from my previous vlog, I, you know, I asked what names would be best for my subbies. Because I don't want to just be calling y'all subbies. Like, I want to have, like, a legit name. I've seen some cute ones. I've seen Macarn Game. Uh, Macarn Game. Carnies. <laughs> That's, like, Macarn, like, you know, broken down. The Carnies. The Carny Game. Like, y'all got some some good ones. So, I'm going to um, leave this open for another day or two. And then I'm going to pick out the winner. I'm going to do a vlog for the winner. And then I'm also going to do like a live for the winner. So that I can show you all what gift you. And y'all know I got style. So you ain't got to worry about no crazy gift. Um, but yeah, y'all. I'm excited. And it's like, to be honest with you, I've never like thought about having a name like when i started my youtube page y'all i was like um le leveling up like we leveling up we're doing something different that's where leveling up came from and then of course we put our last name you know down i've seen some cute ones like my favorite um favorite little families uh i've seen the marshall party of five love me some britney love her channel and then Williams um, family of six. I just, I love people's names on YouTube. I feel like your name it symbolizes, I mean, yeah, your vlogs do, but your name symbolizes a lot. Because when you go out and <laughs> you want people to follow you or subscribe, you have to tell them your name and you're going to have to feel like you're giving good energy. So, I'm happy with our little name. Hopefully, y'all are. Oh, that one looking kind of... That one ain't giving. Um, the lady at Bath and Body Works, it was so funny, y'all. Because she was like, 
Well, since you say you're not familiar with like the wrapping part of um things, I'm gonna give you an extra one just in case. I was like, nah, I throw in a couple, a couple, and no extra one. <laughs> but I'm getting it though. Let me not underestimate myself. It's just these nails. I would have been done with these things. I'm getting hungry now, y'all. I got a fireplace going. It's crackling. It just feels so good. I wish Big Daddy was off tomorrow. Um, because we could definitely chill and relax. Some days, sometimes I be wanting to play hooky. Like, you know how we used to do back in the day at school? Call out of work. Take that, take that little point and, and just let's go out and play hooky. So all of them are done, y'all. One more. That's what they looking like. <sighs> yes, y'all. But this is the fireplace. I'm here by myself, y'all. I love my daughter to death. I love Mooney with all my heart. But I really be needing a break. And I just, me and Trey had that talk. I was like, baby, look, I work from home, but I also need time for me too. You know what I'm saying? Like, take her. I mean, I know she's a mama's girl. Let her get adjusted to daddy too. Like, we got to come together because it's not it's not working. He was like, I understand. I'll take her. I was like, eh, he ain't got no choice. So, yeah. I'm supposed to be upstairs getting out their school clothes. So, that's what I'm about to take y'all to do. Put this up. Okay. Mm. Y'all, the water finally unfroze. The pipes finally unfroze. It did not take long at all. I thought it was gonna take super long, but it didn't take long. Question, do y'all still get y'all's kids clothes out? Comment below. Like, not the babies. More so like the eight, nine, 10 year olds. Cause if I don't get their clothes out, they'll be looking like who did it and ran. Noria try to put a dress on in a heartbeat. Mid-fall. I think their clothes is in my room. Yeah. I need to do some serious cleaning. <sighs> Look at my baby's rooms. <sighs> I gotta do some cleaning. Y'all, we painted these walls like a while back. Um, let me catch my breath. <sighs> okay. We painted these walls a while back. Um, they wanted pink. They wanted their little mirror behind the door. So I gave them their mirror. Speaking of that, they need to clean it. We did a pretty good job. Y'all look how the L sit. <laughs> um, we actually painted theirs as well. They wanted purple to match their curtains. So yeah. Getting school clothes out is a job for any mother. Why they ain't got no light in their room? Okay. I think I'm going to let Haya wear her little reindeer outfit tomorrow. This is cute. can do that. It's a job, y'all. Being parents is truly a job. I went through that winter clothes, and it's like, to me, it looks like they mixed them back up. Like, anybody got time for this? So let me get on the floor. Oh. We're going to go through the clothes together. My kids. See? Why is Nova's pants in Lonnie and Aya's room? This is what I'm talking about. I know I'm not the only one. I know I'm not the only one. Okay. Lonnie can do black. They have a half a day tomorrow um, for school. So I'll be picking them up at one tomorrow. Again, my day is gone. How lovely. Why can't I find that clothes? That clothes got to be in my room, y'all. Got to. That's my fault for not folding when I was supposed to be folding. <sighs> I'm still debating, y'all, if I want to do this court thing. Y'all know I 
talk to y'all and tell y'all almost everything. Um, I'm still debating. I don't think I want to do it, but my mom was like, you know, I need you there. I want you there and all that good stuff. And I'm like, everybody, you know, we adjust to grief differently. And honestly, I feel like I handled the situation as good as I could. Like, when I tell y'all, I did my sister's makeup while she was in the casket. I did her eyelashes. Me and my cousins, we did her makeup. We put her piercings in. Because ain't no, my sister ain't going out like that. So we made sure she was good. But, y'all, I don't think I can handle the situation because it is like a homicide. I don't think I can handle going in the courthouse hearing and seeing because i'm pretty sure you you know the video like i can't handle that and i don't know how to tell my mother that i'm not strong enough to you know go through that and then i don't want her to be alone because i lost my father two years prior so she passed two years after my dad and it's just me and my mother so it's like I'm stuck between a rock and a hard place. I don't want to let her down, but I don't want to let myself down. And y'all know I suffer from anxiety and depression. And I don't want to go back to that. You know, like my sister wouldn't want that. So I, I like, I talked to Trey and he was like, it's better if you just, you know, support her at home when she comes out, support her. But also just, you know, knowing that like my mom's home, I mean, my mom's there and like, I'm not there, like not... Because her heart's not good, y'all. I mean, you lost your child. That's going to, you know. So, that's what has been beating me down. And with anxiety, just keeping it real, y'all. It makes you overthink. It makes you have heart palpitations. It makes you, like, I've literally been to the point where I was about to pass out. Like, from having an anxiety attack. Like, it's, it's real. So, for my health and my kids, I just think it's best that I don't go but then like the back of my head is like boom you know you're leaving your mom so that's what I'm battling right now and I think I think I'm throwing myself into like YouTube like not throwing myself because I love what I do on here don't get me wrong but I think that's my way of coping because we were supposed to do this together so when I do it it's like I know she's up there looking down happy but yeah it's, it's rough, y'all. And I know y'all are my virtual family. I know y'all got my back 100%. Whichever decision I make. Um, but it's, it's definitely going to be tough. Definitely going to be tough, y'all. But I'm going to continue to pray and get through it. And I'm sorry, y'all. I don't put a bummer on y'all. Like, I was all back to body work and then come to this, like... The realization of what's you know what's gonna come so i'm sorry y'all but i be needing to talk vent that's what my platform is about we vent we talk we go through things and we overcome it so that's what we shall be doing okay i still haven't got that close out don't judge me please don't judge me and i won't judge you Every day, y'all got a song. I'm telling you. I gotta go through. I gotta fold these clothes. I'm over here getting putting stuff in baskets. Like, I just been all over the place. I'm trying to find something cute for Lonnie. Let's see. That's Lonnie's. And y'all, Lonnie and Haya wear, like, the same type. Like, they wear, they're in the same. Because Lonnie's so um small that Haya and Lonnie were the same size so I get confused with their clothes lord help me all right so Nova's is good Haya's is good Lonnie's good now I gotta think I mean I gotta find Nori's so what is my Nori bug gonna wear Man, I gotta iron some of this Trey's gonna be calling any minute asking me if I Came up with what we're going to eat. I'm going to be like, no. And I'm blaming y'all. I'm going to be like, I was talking to YouTube. We got wrapped up talking. And they wouldn't let me go. <laughs> I'm blaming y'all. He ain't going to say nothing to y'all. 
but he sure would come for me. Now I just seen the outfit that go with this. Boom, there go Norris. Thank you, Sheen. She in. There we go. Do y'all slack on laundry like me? Cause when I tell you, I be slacking. Like at one point in time, I was doing it consistently on Sundays. And then my mom, who is very superstitious and old school, she was like, I know you ain't washing no darn clothes on no Sunday. That is the day you supposed to rest. How dare you? And I'm like, mama, it is not that deep. Clothes are getting washed and that's that. But yeah, she wasn't feeling that, y'all. Not at all. She was not feeling it. Gotta get back on it though. <sighs> what should I eat tonight, y'all? Help me out. <sighs> I need help. I need to figure out what I'm gonna eat. Okay, so now I'm about to go set their clothes in their room. You know, I'm tired of getting their clothes out. If they wanna act like little grown ladies, they should be well aware of getting their own clothes out. And they're not. <sighs> Y'all, I'm excited. We're still doing the, um, I'm going to set y'all up. Keep moving, y'all. I'm sorry. Um, I'm trying to, uh, no, what was I talking about? We're going to the Christmas lights tomorrow. Super excited. Going with our cousins. It's my first time getting to vlog, like, the Christmas lights. So, I'm excited, even though we go every year. Okay. Got Hayas and I got Lonnie's. All right, just like that, Mama Mo. Let me start. Okay, y'all. Let me get my living room cleaned. Gotta go back upstairs. Let me get my living room cleaned, and then I'm gonna go ahead and edit this vlog. This one is not gonna be as long as the previous ones, but. I still wanted to come through and share with y'all what was going on in the world, in the Macarns world. And I will pick up my camera later. Bye.